Hey there, this is Alex Uhas, and I'm Skyping Pato Hebert with the two curators of Perpetude, and this is our opening welcome on YouTube, and we're putting this whole thing on YouTube because we want to model better, more complex, more intellectual, more beautiful, more artistic, community building practices on this site instead of criticizing it and other social media for what they can't do. We built a whole show around that. And um, we collaborated together out of um, years of attempting to do that kind of work in our own communities. Um, now we're trying to do it on YouTube in a much bigger, vaster, broader place. When I wanted to interact with you and curate with you and partner with you on this, I really was looking forward to your guidance about what it meant to put something in a room, in a gallery, in an art gallery. Um, you know, why not just on YouTube? And we've had a lot of really exciting conversation about that, and the show's really built. Can you talk a little about that for our um, audience who's coming for the first time to the show? Yeah, I think space is really interesting. <laughs> like what happens when the lens affects space, and, and gallery is one of the spaces that interests me as an artist, and I think it's interesting to a lot of people. All the things that you're excited about and challenged by on YouTube, I think many of us are trying to figure out with art spaces, right? What happens when we do strange things in them, and it gets, you know, somehow uh, disruptive. And um, at, at Basics, how do we connect more meaningfully in galleries? And how might we change each other more profoundly on YouTube? I think that set of questions really for me is driving this project together. And this question of space, how do we relate in the worlds we're in? And then what happens when um, we put that on YouTube? It's interesting. Yeah, and then for me, just this tension between um, what happens in a live space. We all understand that when we're breathing the same air, looking each other in the eye, being, you know, listening to each other and having this live experience that's lost. And mm -hmm. what happens here, and not saying one is better than the other, but beginning to produce values for both of these kinds of ways of being and beginning to connect them in more um, purposeful ways. And that is the title of the show, Repurposing Social Media Spaces. Is there any other repurposing you'd want to flag right here I mean, over the course of the next 32 days, there's going to be a lot of work on this site that does um, answers that question for us and builds on that idea. But anything you want to introduce up front? I guess I would just say that the 32 days relate to a new artwork being presented in the physical gallery, one, one work per day. But our hope is that this project it goes on in perpetuity, and that's where your presence, all of you who are watching this, whether you're watching during the first 32 days of the project or 32 years from now, <laughs> you matter and your participation and presence matter. And uh, it's, a, it's a crazy adventure. We're not quite sure what's going to happen to it as our spaces start doing what they do. But thank you for joining us. It's going to be exciting. Thanks so much. And uh, come back and make something as well. I'm going to wrap our video.